BBBOD's What is Personal Space? Hi! I'm so glad to see you! Wanna go play? Come on! Yikes! Yikes! Oh. Come on! Let's go! Oh no, no! Mom! Yikes! No! 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 What are you doing? Don't oh. you wanna play? Too close! You're too close! What? What's too close? You're too close to me! But you're my friend. Don't you want to play with me? Not anymore. You're too close. You're in my bubble. Bubble. I don't see any bubble. You're being mean. What's all the yelling about? She's being mean. He's too close. Oh, it looks like you're having a personal space problem. Personal space? Is that like outer space where the astronauts go? No, silly, you're in my personal space. You're too close. Everyone has personal space. Put your arms out in front of you as far as they will go. See that space between your body and the tips of your fingers? Yeah, I see it. That's your personal space bubble. It's a space that you control. Yeah, you need to ask permission to come into my bubble. Oh, what if I want to hug? That's a great question. Hugs are wonderful, but only if both people agree to the hug. I did not agree to your hug. Oh, does that mean you don't like me? Of course I like you, but I wasn't ready for a hug. I'm protecting my personal space bubble. Hugs can be uncomfortable when they're unexpected. Oh, what if I really need a hug? Ask first. If you ask for a hug, then I will be ready and I won't feel uncomfortable. It's very important to ask permission anytime you want to be in someone's personal space bubble. Oh, well, well, let me get this straight. If I want a hug or to stand close to you, I can ask. Well, what did you say no? Sometimes I don't feel like hugging, touching, or even standing close together. I might say no if I'm having a hands-off day. You're still my friend, and I still like you. I just don't want to be so close. That's okay. Just remember to tell people no thank you. You could even tell your friends that today is a hands-off day. Uh, I, I think I understand. My little cousin always wants to hold my hand, but sometimes his hands are sticky. And he grabs my hand, and I don't like it very much, and sometimes I yell at him. It's better to tell people if you don't want to be touched. You don't have to have a reason. It's your personal space bubble. You can also ask for a high five or a fist bump. Those touches don't get inside my personal space bubble, and we can still greet each other. Well, what about moms and other family members? Do I have to ask them for a hug? Well, I'm glad you asked. Family members are part of your close circle. These are people who are safe to invite into your personal bubble, like moms and dads and grandparents. Sometimes a surprise hug from one of those people in your close circle will feel good. Remember, you can still tell people in your close circle, no thank you, I don't feel like hugs today. So, if I use kind words, it's okay to say no to hugs or close contact. <laughs> You're so smart. It sounds like you know how to protect your personal space bubble using kind words like no thank you or not today. Oh, I always like hugs and touches. Now I know that if I want to be close to someone, I have to ask to enter their personal space bubble. Next time I'll ask, I'll wait for you to answer before I touch you. Well, thanks for listening to me. You know, you really are a great friend. And best of all, you both know how to protect your personal space bubble. I know that if I want my friends and family members to feel comfortable when I hug them, I have to ask their permission to enter their personal space. Everyone will know that I still like them, even if I don't want to be touched, when I say no thank you to a hug or close touch. We will all feel more comfortable when we are in control of our personal space bubble. Yay. Yay, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Don't, Don't forget, forget, like, share, and subscribe to BBOD.